Hello friends, welcome to my channel. Today's my video is not about data analysis or data science. As you know, I'm Ukrainian and currently all Ukraine is suffering because of war. It all started on 21st of February, that morning Russia invaded Ukraine. Air strikes were carried out on many military infrastructure facilities in almost all regions of Ukraine. And that morning, all our citizens woke up to the horrible sounds of bombs. The war has started. A residential building was severe. With a Z, turning on allies call that a Swedish sheltering. Russian government declared it as a demilitarization and denazification of Ukraine. But the point is, there are no nationalists in our country. Ukrainians are peaceful and kind people. Believe me, we're generous, sensitive, responsive, and what is more important, we are free. Free people. Ukrainians have always spoken both Russian and Ukrainians. There has never been oppression on Russian-speaking people or people of other nationalities. We're able to elect our government, we're able to communicate with officials, we allow our country and our president. We do not need to be saved by Russian authorities. The second point is that Russian government stated that they're shelling only military infrastructure. Let me show you some pictures. Does it look like military infrastructure? You're right. These are residential buildings, hospitals, kindergartens. A few days ago, they dropped a bomb on a maternity hospital. They bombed the theater in Mariupol where more than 1500 people, women and children were hiding. Ordinary civilians are dying, children are dying. People are forced to leave their homes and to live in a basement. But I believe that we will stand and win. Our defenders are strong and we are very thankful to them. We are trying to help. The truth is on our side. And I want to say thank you to all of you guys who are demonstrating in different cities around the world and support Ukrainians. I will also leave the link with the possible ways to help uh, down below. Shortly, you may help us by posting the truth in your social media, by asking your government to help us. You may also donate to our army and civilians. I will leave the link to Ukrainian National Bank fundraising account and crypto programs. You may host Ukrainians or hire them. Guys, any help will be useful. From my side, I will try to make useful content about data analysis, data sciences, or to say thank you for your help and your support. Thank you for being with Ukrainians these days.